Let's wait for Twitch to start. And we are live. Hello, everyone. Give me a second. I just need to turn down the music a little. There. And the music. Wow. The menu music in this game is so loud. So, yeah. Here we are. Back to Fallout 4. And we are going to be going... Basically back into the game, into our survival game. And we are gonna be... Well, basically doing what we can to survive and... We have a job. We are, another settlement needs our help. So let's go, let's go do that. Uh, continue. Yep, yeah, that's Mike. Enter. In survival, fast travel is disabled. If you wish to be somewhere... You have to get there the old-fashioned way. Oh god, so no fast travel, okay. See, I barely use fast travel anyway. <sighs> so yeah, we are back in the game. It has been like three days since I played this. So let's see if I still remember. I know we saved, so we might as well just straight up go. So, our job is to go over there. Okay. That means over there. Thankfully, the game still shows you uh, markers. It would be kind of horrifying if the game would not do that. Okay, give me a second. Need to do a little something. We got to post on... Uh a thing that I'm actually streaming. Give me okay, now we are now we are going. Okay. Wait, why is my HP so low? I slept. Sleeping is supposed to. Eh, whatever. I'm just gonna stim pack, I guess. I could just def def call steak. Yeah. Oh my god, did holy shit it feels slow. Oh shit, it feels it feels so slowly. Oh no. So before we do uh, what I wanted to do, uh I know that if we follow these cables we will get to another We will get to another area where there's uh, a settlement. So we might as well go there. Quickly, water. Oh my god, so much purified water. How do you die of, of thirst in this game is beyond me. A potato. Yeah, this is the place that I was talking about. You are running like an idiot. Look at me, I look like an idiot. <laughs> That's an interesting thing to increase my levels of. That's close enough, stranger. We're a peaceful farm. We don't want any trouble. I'm friendly. It's okay, I'm friendly. Not looking to cause any trouble. If you say so, but be warned, we're armed here. So don't try anything. Let me tell you, farming ain't easy. Out in the field all day, every day, and every minute of it. Spent watching your back. Farming's hard work. Won't argue with that. Blake Abernathy. You new to the Commonwealth? Yes. I'm... Yeah. We could say that. Good to see a new face. How about you? Ever think about working the land? Yes. I'm sure I'll give it a try someday. Well, good luck to you then. Maybe I'll see you at the Diamond City Market someday and we'll do a swap. Word of advice though. If you do start up a farm, be ready to deal with the raiders. Why do all the hard work when you can just take what you want at gunpoint? You need to do what you can to protect you and your family. It ain't that simple. They're well armed and there's lots of them. If I drive them off, they'll be back with twice as many men. Last time those raiders hit us, my daughter Mary tried to stand up to them. Now she's buried out back of the house. Only 21 years old. 
and they shot her down without a thought. That's why we need the Minutemen back. And the sooner, the better. From what I've seen, nobody out here's got it easy. Yeah, well, that don't help us sleep any easier. I don't have much to offer, but those raiders that killed Mary, okay. they took the locket too. It's been in Connie's family for generations. If you could get it back, it'd mean a lot to us. Oh, Gordon. Don't worry. I'll get that locket back for you. Good. Connie feels like it's a part of Mary. I don't think she'll rest easy again as long as it's gone. Okay. So we have a job now. Now that one is closer, so I'm actually probably gonna go for that. So these guys have Tato's. What we need is corn. Also, give me a second. I actually need to increase the volume of talking. Like, the volume of talking is so much more quiet. Even though I have it, like, really high anyway. So, question. Can I sleep in your bed? <laughs> That's a really interesting question. Owned. Owned. And it's owned. Shite. So, no, I cannot sleep in their bed. I literally cannot save here. Right now, until I take over. So, this thing. It's on the way, so I might as well. I'm gonna go back. To my place. I'm gonna save. Can I by any chance... Where's the workshop here? No, seriously, where the fuck is the workshop? It's always outside. I'm retarded. Yeah, I'm not allowed to this place yet. Okay, so we are gonna go back home. That's, that's complicated. That sucks, kinda. So we are gonna go back home. I'm gonna drop a save. And we now have two quests. One of which is actually close by. Ooh. Ported light pipe pistol. And? So, what about this pearl that you are saying is better? Yeah, that's better. That. Thankfully, now that I have uh, Tato's with me, I can plant them in Sanctuary. For better food. Okay, that jumping is actually very dangerous because something tells me that the game made it so that, you know, let's say broken legs are much more, you know, of a big deal. Okay, seems like I'm gonna be doing this at night. So yeah, we saved, let's go. We have a really powerful pistol. And if we need to snipe, we can definitely snipe. I'm gonna be spamming Q every now, every now and then for the VATS. It's so weird that the VATS is now Q. It, it was always V. I believe it was actually V even, even in old. Though so there the VATS was basically aim shot. It was not actually, you know, using VATS. Yeah, there's someone. The Raider. There's a attack dog and another Raider. Yeah, that little thing over there is a Raider. Motherfucker. They're not showing on the compass. Is that a feature? Do you need like uh, a scouting skill or something for that? Laying down. 
Okay, murder they're going. That guy is dead. Okay, let's use some uh, PUBG strats. Let's use the 3D look in order to uh, cheat, basically. See over hills. This is why I never played uh, third person in uh, PUBG because you can cheat horribly in third person. And yep. Oh, there's another. And over there is the dog. What did I miss? The fuck? Can you hear me press the Q so many times? I know bullets can kill me in very few shots now because this is not just survival, this is also playing on the highest difficulty. That means enemies take like million bullets. And I die in like... Deleting the dog would be so useful. Okay, the dog has been deleted. I love how the raiders just do not care. The dog died? <laughs> Who cares? Over there. It's because of the bushes. Like the game, the bushes in this game, uh, they actually make it so that you literally don't see them. But by the way, I literally just slept. And the game is already going, you have not slept. God damn it. Trying to actually be tactical. Again, bushes. They can see through them. I cannot. Can hear more gunfire. This really is like PUBG. They're shooting and there's another person already shooting you in the back. In PUBG, whoever shoots first usually dies horribly. Because PUBG is for people who have no spine. Jesus. I swear to God they nerf the accuracy on the guns. I think they just shot each other. Go around here. Use this to see around the corner. Hey, Zoji Spawn, welcome back to the stream, man. 
The hardest mode for this, I probably won't buy this until the game of the year edition is cheaper. Uh, I mean, to be honest, the DLCs are not really worth your time. They're not actually that good. Man, if each combat is gonna be like this, this game is gonna get much harder. <laughs> okay. Enjoy, bitch. We are close enough. Well, you bitch. Gotcha. Okay, that was our uh, first foray into actually fighting bandits. <laughs> okay, that could have gone so much better. But hey, we can cook food if needed. Forty-five. Ooh, forty-five. Actually. I remember from playing this and they said power armor was kind of required for max difficulty. Eh, uh, we will see. What about the height? That was... Oh, more. Can we drop a sleep? Oh my god. In here. Yes. Drop a save. Okay, we need to eat and drink. Mm, delicious red roach. Am I still hungry? Or was I ever hungry? God damn it. It's, ha it's hard to tell. Yeah. How close are we to the place? We are getting closer. Remember last time I was here in my base game, there was a mole rat that had a bomb, like mine on it. Ow. When you hurt yourself with a gun in real life, as you're holding a gun in a game. Okay, let's go, let's go up. Okay, we're almost there. Oh, hey, there's another bed. That's useful. Another save. How am I tired from the lack of sleep? What the fuck? I literally just slept. What the hell was that? Bitch, die. The pistol is bigger than my head, what the fuck? Fuck you, dog. It's okay, if my dog does not see that I'm, you know, shooting dogs, then it's okay. That's not sleepy, that's a nap! Dude, I can like, after, okay, after one, one hour of nap, I, I'm capable of functioning for several hours of work. It's another drop. Okay. So that's a uh, satellite over there is where we need to go. Okay, we have a deer in front of us. Would be good uh, to get some meat out of the deer. Second. Let's pull out. Take back the colonies. Oh, there's, there, there's a power armor there. What? 
Wow! Holy shit! The power of taking back the colonies is not big enough. Prepare Shotake. So do I have a do I have a core on me? And there's a guy who just straight up died next to it. And go up there. I don't know, it's not worth it. I'm dead. Oh wait! Oh wait, these do not attack. Meat! Oh, I just unloaded my load straight into that deer's anus. <laughs> that kickball on the fucking mole rat. Too in danger. There's still somewhere here. Where are you, bitch? Show yourself. Is that because of that doe there? Oh dear. Oh dear. Shit. Oh dear. <laughs> okay, time to take some more meat. Where the fuck is the enemy who's spotting me? This is playing World of Tanks, you know. Where right the fuck is the guy spotting me from? What the fuck? <laughs> Bitch. Probably gonna retreat back up there. I'm probably gonna retreat back uh, to that vantage point where I had a bat. Just to save. Man, it's really easy to lose, uh, you know, effort and time in this game now, because you cannot save normally. I guess it does increase the difficulty. Also, the FOV in this game is absolutely brutally bad. Does anyone actually know how to set the FOV to something normal, like 90? What? Who can see me? Bitch! These reflexes. I fucking knew it. Okay. Whoa, bitch! Holy shit, the mole rats! Wow, the mole rats really want me dead. It's like I ate their fucking, you know, brethren. Want some molestation? Yeah. Murdered the shit out of them. Let's actually drop a save now. Yeah, now that it's day, I can actually see things. There's a box. I can I, I actually see one. Let's take back the colonies, bitches. <laughs> what happened in Fallout would never happen if the colonies were still British. Mwah!
can see. Mist. Okay, so that's. I don't see any more horrible, horrible rider people. Let's switch to the mid-range pistol. Switch to that gun. Molotov cocktail, hot plate. Ah, hot plate is useful. Going to hiding. Let's keep our eyes open. Remember, a raider can end our life very quickly in this game. Right now. Shit, come. Oh, that's uh, you have to go down down there. Shit, I forgot we actually had to go down there. Sucks. Let's clear the area here first, because something tells me there's still gonna be some. Shit! Accidentally threw a grenade. I'm too used to holding out in uh, PUBG to go slower. How do you go slower in this? Oh, okay. Okay, close range. Go for the shot, okay? Drop a save. Oh, they got attacked by all rats. Go check it out up here now that I actually have a save. Yeah, one of them got killed by, I think, a mole rat. That's kind of sad. Then again, I almost got killed by a mole rat as well. Yep, yeah, they got like super murdered by mole rats. Fucking mole rats, of all things. I would feel so much shame if more would kill me. Probably gonna happen at some point, but you know, I would still be ashamed. Okay. So uh, let's go down. Let's go down, let's be like super careful. Fiber optics and crystal. Ooh, that's actually useful. Well, this is an area. Purify water. Uh, nothing too big, though. That guy literally just... What the hell? Yeah, what? I'm gonna leave her... A little surprise. I 
no way I'm cracking this. I really know the heck of Eric. Well, she died. <laughs> okay, so we killed one chick and a dog. The game is actually more similar to Stalker now. <laughs> In a good way. Because it seems guns do more damage. Right away. That is not how you clean a toilet. Just saying. You usually are supposed to use the, plung uh, the plunger, you know, the other way around. Just saying. I mean, that is one way how to get out of handcuffs. We need more mines. Mines are actually really good for us right now. Mines are literally our best friend. Okay, so we know there's more enemies in the area. Red X. Oh, okay. Oh, there's gonna be so much more. Okay, do not break the bobby pin. To the right. Nope. To the left. Good. Sweet. And it's Jed, which you are probably just gonna sell. Take the armor. Definitely take the duct tape. <clears throat> I wish I had more mines. Mines are really good in this game. And in New Vegas. In New Vegas, mines are really good as well. In Fallout 3, uh, not so much. In Fallout 3, mines are kinda meh. It's because like enemies usually do not get like spawned in specific areas. So mines are actually not that useful. Not to mention enemies usually do not patrol in very specific ways. Oh shit, there's a, there's a guy right here. <gasps> oh, I know you're here. I'll find you. That fucker has a minigun. That fucker has a minigun. What the fuck? That is a little OTT, don't you think, game? What the fuck was that? Yeah, that's the guy with the minigun. Only a fucking coward. You mean a person who wants to live? Just saying. Show your, face. your face is a face.
Okay. <laughs> Scared out, there should be. Yep, they are coming. Come on out. I'll make it. Wow. Holy shit, did you die quickly. Fuck. I don't even understand what killed me there. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. Okay. So this is how we're gonna play it. It's it's one hit for me, but it's two hits for them. And I cannot save. Good one. So this is how we are gonna roll. We are basically gonna be assholes. I don't actually know. Oh, and it moves me back into the... Already it's going much better. <laughs> so much better is basically slightly but also much. The guy. Come on, bitch. Come on, bitch, go around. Come on, bitch. I've been doing stuff before this game even existed. We do kill the guy with the minigun. The guy with the minigun is the biggest problem. So I'm gonna create this area into... A kill zone. If we need to retreat... This is the corridor that we need to retreat through. Molotov, molo, molo, molotov.
What creeps me out is that I cannot see them on my compass anymore. If she co uh, comes over there, I will shoot her. If she comes the other other way, uh, she will activate the mine. Okay. Okay, there's still two people. One male, one female. At least two people. Oh, are you fucking serious? Mm. Oh, this is bad. This is retarded. And all the way back. <laughs> Why am I detected? What am I detected by? There is nothing. Man, this is shit. This is not even close to being fun. Okay, stalker is difficult, but you can, you know, auto save your way to victory. If you are at least a little good. But this is actually retarded. Like, okay, so everyone kills you in one bullet. And there's like millions of them. And you don't have scope weapons to be able to actually fight that. Where's the chick? She's always here and now she's not? The fuck? Fucking dogs. Oh hey, I'm gonna show up and then I'm gonna immediately run away. I wonder if you can mod in the ability to save. It would actually make me really f like happy because this is retarded. This is not fun. What? I mean, all I can do is to just go there, kill someone, retreat, wait for the fucking stealth thingy to you know go away. What? A dog survived a shotgun shell where a human will not. That's a good joke, game. So no one is laughing. See, that's what should happen when you shoot a... What? I'm reloading, goddammit. Why is the button the same? How can they not find me? Just follow the corpses. No, oh, you didn't. Where are they? You cannot even lure them because they are too retarded to find you. Dumbass coward. What? How can you see me? Oh, this is... The survival mode only shows everything bad about the mechanics of this game. A guy can literally see you through a wall. But people cannot find you, you know, based on two, three corpses. And now I will basically say, I will quick save right now, you know, so that I can continue killing people, but... 
Norm normally I would do that, but now I cannot because the survival says now nah, you cannot save. You know what the game wants you to do? It wants you to leave and go save. So it basically turns every encounter into a save fest. So instead of, you know, basically letting you auto save or, you know, quick save, it forces you to save by going outside and sleeping in a bed that is like very conveniently very close by. Ooh, that's... How is this? How is this any any different from like auto saving or quick saving? How is this? How is this in any way, shape, or form different? Except it's wasting my time. In a game that is already made of wasting time. Ugh. I love how there's a key. You know, there's another key. Now I basically have to go, try to kill people, if I die I will respawn and, you know, then I have to go try again. Except this time it's gonna take much more time because, you know, this game is made of shit. And god forbid I will not be sneaking. If you are not sneaking you will just die because they kill you in one bullet. Oh, I forgot shotguns in this game have a range of like one millimeter. Jesus. She deleted more HP than I did. I'm not the main fucking character. Come on. Did she actually lose me? I think she actually lost me. Are you serious? Okay, we killed the person. Time to go back and save the game. Man, this is so much fun. I'm having so much fun. Uh... Man, why did I pl start playing survival? This is actually bad. How am I overtired? I'm literally sleeping. I am literally sleeping just to save. This game is so broken. I go to bed in order to take a one hour nap and the game is like you are overtired. It's like saying you are hungry when you are eating. What the fuck? Or you are thirsty after you know during like as you are drinking water. The fuck? Why is the load taking so long? Why is the game loading so long? Did it crash? The fuck? Followed for stuck on loading screen. Hmm. The fuck? Did load? Like, I even hear the music, that's the funny part. Yeah, that's not gonna load. I, I need to kill the game. 
Bethesda games. 100% working. Uh, give me a second. Still not working? Still not working. So give me a second. That means I will have to do the entire thing again, by the way. Oh, I hate this. I hate this already. This is like... Okay, so the whole not saving thing would work if your game would not crash. Like this. Like, this is not even a normal crash. This is like... Advanced crash, because it makes no fucking sense. Ugh... I have to go back to the fucking high path again. <laughs> this is so bad. How can this be any... How do you make a game that is worse than Follow New Vegas? Like, that actually takes fucking effort. Like, someone had to actually go ahead and, like, put down, like, ideas on how to make a game worse than New Vegas. At least Vegas is a hardcore mode lets you save. What the fuck? Who thought this is gonna be a good idea? It's just wasting time. It's wasting my time, time anyone who's gonna be watching this video. It's literally wasting everyone's time. Only for me to now get killed because, you know, that's how this fucking thing works. Do I still have my fucking... Gr no, I only have Molotovs. That I'm gonna get, get myself killed by, by the way, because, you know, God forbid, you know, Molotovs would actually work how they kind of work. Of course that person would not die to the fire. Why would they? Come on, stop looking for me. Why am I still in caution? Before this would work, but now, nope. Fucking finally. Took you long enough, you fucked out. <laughs> Doing caution. There's still someone. How can there still be someone? I've killed like literally this probably still the minigun person. Yep, yeah, it was the minigun person. Can I carry a minigun? Possibly. Yeah, I can carry the minigun. I just, I'm, I just have the minigun so that no one else can get it. I'm actually streaming the game. This is actually something I need to check. Yeah, I'm streaming the game. Okay. Oh, what am I gonna be fucking fighting now? That's it. Jesus. Mm -hmm. 
Wow, this Red Roach. Seriously? Just let me shoot. Let me... Oh my god, this shotgun fucking sucks. You cannot even shoot a fucking red roach. What the fuck are these red roaches made of? I'm actually running away from red roaches because the shotgun cannot kill them. Yeah, watch this. A, a red roach that can take fucking three shotgun shells. What the fuck? Is this how you do difficulty? Enemies, you know, being fucking bullet sponges. Rad roaches of all things. That's three. That's four. Four shotgun shells. Are you fucking real? Oh no, not the rad roach. The most dangerous creature known to man. Jesus fucking Christ. How many enemies are gonna be in this one small area? I am actually sick of enemies at this point. Oh, this is gonna be a quick stream. I'm already fucking angry. That's the fucking locket that I'm supposed to take. You know what? I'm actually gonna drop. Fucking minigun. Why can't I zoom in? Am I retarded? Is my character retarded? Well, I'm... Are we done packing? What are you packing? Uh, just drop. Just checking. Red Roaches, the most dangerous enemy of the survival. Just fucking die. One bullet. Two bullet. Three bullets. Fucking four bullets to kill a... To kill a fucking Red Roach. Are you real? This is retarded. Done? Are we done with this retardness? Fuck. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna pick up the important thing. This unrusted thing could be useful. Yep, yeah, that's radiation. Get a few rats to get more money. How do you? Anything in it? Does not seem like it. My luggage for my plane trip tomorrow. Dude, you always. You, you just keep going places. What the fuck? I wish I had your money. Got it. Wait. Hey. How, do, how do you get money to keep traveling like this? Cigar. Army helmet. I may actually have to uh, rush the railroad west line in order to actually get access to armor plating for clothes. Okay, now we can basically just loot this place. I hope. I hope the game does not have a, like another insane thing for me. Ack, ack. Serpentine. Open. Yarn, pink glass. 
important so far. Desk fine. Aluminium. Aluminium, not aluminium. Chalk. The fuck is chalk? As in, like, what does it have in it? Like, I know what, uh... Hey, Shia Shock, you just missed me, literally... Die, like, 18 times in this one area. Because survival is absolutely retarded. Like, not even in a good way. I over the book. I actually need to stop picking those. Here. Also, wait. I get in card. Okay. Aluminium. Surgical tray. Ooh. Sniper armor. Jesus, dude. I wish we had shit like that. But hey, you know, was born in a shitty country, I guess. Uh, we bought. It's alright. I try to only use an realistic survival type to run. Uh, I mean, it would be kind of good if the game would not crash like a motherfucker. Either allow me to save, or make it, make it so that your game will not crash. Don't have to. Because, you know, it doesn't feel like I'm making mistakes, it, it feels like every loading screen could be a crash. Which is exactly what I hate in games. And I understand, you know, these buffers, they, you know, they, do, they cannot make games. Well, not only buffers, they're like every fucking developer these days. Uh. So for Witcher. I never had problems with Witcher. But hey, you know, Slavic developers, you know, people who actually, you know, care about games being good. Just funny because we, you know, CD Projekt Red is from, you know, Poland, which is like a really poor country. But hey, I guess it, you know, it takes people from poor country to make a game that works, I guess. <sighs> Oh yeah, the three grades, lip lighter, scalpel, my invent, almost over the line. Jesus, that's heavy. Okay. Okay, all of this is basically just gonna say system error. No need to worry about it. Cause you know, fuck making like actual story. Fuck wanting to know, you know, what happened in here. Oh, by the way, in sur on survival, it takes four shotgun shells from an improved shotgun to kill a red roach. That is absolutely retarded and should never be. Okay. Shuffle back. I didn't want to pick up the fucking gun. Ugh. Yeah, drop that shit. Desk fan. How can a desk fan be that heavy? I have a desk fan. It's not that heavy. It's not like three fucking kilos. <sighs> yeah, I'm dropping the tan suit, the red bandana. I have a desk fan. It's it's not three kilograms. Much 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 lighter. Oh, microscope is important. Arm clock, cigarette carton, pre-war money, bottles. What do we have? I hate when it just doesn't. Oh, it's a pipe. It's a pipe gun. 
I'm just gonna take the shotgun shell. Why are you asking me? Just let me get them. Pure annoyance. Anger. How could they do this so badly? So... I don't know, right now... Don't ask me right now, because I'm actually fucking angry. Don't ask me right now. To not. Do not want my opinion on Fallout 4 right now. Yes. What do we have? Ooh, lighter. Okay. Well, inventory management. Yay! It's time to have a look at what we need on us and what we do not need. So in apparel, we really cannot get rid of anything. Get rid of that. I could pop buff out and try to just make a run for it. But that's not gonna work for long. Okay, let's see out of these what I do not need. Wait, Chalk gives you asbestos? Okay. Fiber optics, we need that. Oil. Oil. The circuitry and screw, we need that. Uh, we do not need that. There's like a lot of very important shit. The circuitry. We do not need bone. We do not need this. I think that's asbestos. Oh! That's a lot of oil. Yeah, we do not need these. That's fiberglass, we definitely need that. Well, we need fans. I guess I do not need silver right now. Do not need the steel. Do not need the teddy bear. Antiseptic, that's gonna be useful. Hmm. So that did not do much. Oh wait, I can probably drop like all of this, because that's 5mm, I'm never gonna use that. Yep, yeah. back in the line. Okay. And I think that's it. Chest point. Yep, that's it. Time to go home. I don't know, like, we use ki kilograms, so I presume it's kilograms? Oh wait, it's American, it's probably like, whatever Americans use. What, what do Americans use again? I know for, like, distance you use yards. I think you, you still use pounds? Do you use pounds? How am I over tired when I'm literally sleeping? What the fuck game? Okay, we need to get... We need to get from here... We need to get... To Abernathy Farm or home. One of these places needs to go. Go, 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 go. Pounds, unces, tons. So I presume it's pounds, I guess. If so, I do, again, I have no idea how many pounds is a kilogram, so... See, only one country in entirety of Europe actually still uses Imperials. You know, everyone else, you know, switch to the much better, you know, 100 system. Save.
Oh, Sanctuary. You have no idea how much I want to be back in Sanctuary. Fahrenheit is colder than Celsius. Why? Because it's, it's German? One pound is about a loaf of bread. That's so about a kilogram. Then again, your bread and our bread is something else. For instance, over here we make we make soup into bread. Two pounds is one kilogram. So what's what's the carry what's the carrying capacity of my character then? It's about fifty and twenty five. That's seventy five. Yeah, that's about right. That's about what a human can carry. No, 75 is actually like if you have a backpack then 75 is not that bad a big backpack ah uh, home sweet home bitches what's he doing there why are you in the water again what the fuck dude stop being in the water that's so weird Preston, what the fuck? Why are you in the water? It's fucking irradiated. You are a mental patient. Oh wait, I need to level. Blah! Okay, so what do I want to increase? But the lockpicking would be pretty good. Arrow so cheap. I think it's time to start thinking about what we are gonna be using for gun. I mean, Rifleman is probably the best thing. Hmm. It's, it's a question. What should I go for? Should I go for pistols or for rifles? Maybe I... Maybe a melee run would be good. Ganfu. Hmm. I don't know. I'm just gonna go with the rifles. It just seems like you're doing bigger damage when the enemies around me are spongy as fuck. Is gonna be more important and i'm just gonna have to limit myself to like two guns one long range and one like short range okay okay we have way too many mortals comes on what's gone do you mean endurance and yeah probably but the problem is Enemies will level up faster than me. So I need to keep the damage up. Can I fucking do it with a mouse? No, this is this is a console game. Of course you cannot do it with a mouse. Are you crazy? I mean to get rid of some shit. Yeah, we need to cook. 
claws need to go away. Probably have way too much water on me. Oh, I need to go plant potatoes. Oh, I forget about it. Food. And... Eat. I play Minecraft now. So hopefully someone's gonna work on it at some point. Okay, let's look at what we can do with guns. So Shotake needs some help. I guess. As as Bethesda, they will tell you. Whether that counts for them. Can I not get any nuclear material? More oh, jeez. I cannot really do anything with Shotake. I can actually leave that. It will help the stats any. Medium scope. And a short scope at this point. That's kind of my area of shooting. Rip. Can I do anything with this? I cannot do anything with my gun. So it's not a gun thing. It's... Um, because enemies being generally just way too strong. <laughs> yep. So I'm making a lot of food. That's actually really useful. Anyway, I'm gonna drop a save in one of the beds here. How am I overtired? Okay, I'm just gonna get like a long fucking sleep. As you wish, Todd. Tell me your lies, oh Todd, tell me your lies. No loading screens when we go inside buildings. Sweet, beautiful eyes. I don't even understand what that means. Is that a reference to something? Am I missing a joke? <laughs> oh, what I should drop is definitely the fucking energy core. You know what? It's just go through my shit one more time. Grab that meat. Grab that blood. Meat. Okay, I have way too many chunks. What the actual heck? Get rid of that. One. Oh shit, the steam packs actually made something as well. Oh no. Okay. And okay, none of my guns actually use this ammo. None of my guns use this or this. And the fusion core can go fuck itself. So how's my inventory now? Pretty chill. I'm gonna I'm gonna drop another save. Rutinous, tutinous wasteland. That has to be a reference. That sounds way too familiar. We need to eat.
Yo, properly fed. Okay, so what we need to do is go to Abernathy Farm. And make them join us. I'm gonna build there a bed. And that bed will make it so that I will have another safe area. Then we are gonna go to the other area. And we are gonna see what they want us to do. I think I know what they want us to do and I'm not looking forward to that shit. I always check whether they, you know, the things respawn or not. I want you feathers. Kids, never make your character, you know, look like you. Because this is what you get. How are you even this fat? <laughs> look at this guy. He looks like me. Oh no, he looks like me, god damn it. Up, mate? I've got that locket back for you. You serious? That's great news. Connie's gonna be speechless. I'm sure she'll go lean on her prices after what you've done. And feel free to use our workshop. At least we can. And this place is ours now. <laughs> yes! Kill the cat! No. Let's not kill the cat. So I'm gonna go through this entire area and I'm gonna pick up as many things as I possibly can in order to just fill this place. What did me? Back. Oh, beautiful. Don't mind me, just stealing. Just stealing. Literally stealing everything. Even the shovel. Even the cigar box. Graduated cylinder, okay. That is uh, definitely a word. Stealing everything through fusion cells. 10 millimeter. Fuck sure some useful ammo. Oh my I mean just stealing everything. These are chunks. Only now I've read it. Also we are probably gonna have to get rid of that. Oh, this mattress is okay. I could have actually saved this all this time. Heard bandana. So that we can be edge lords. Okay. And I wanna loot it right now, and then I will be back again. And I'm like gonna actually properly like pick up everything in build mode. But yeah, we will have to give here, like, at least basic protection to make sure people here will not explode when I'm not around, because I can no longer teleport. Okay. So how is this place? It has water, it does not have defense. I hope you didn't like that. Store. Store. Breaking everything. I'm breaking my.
You see, I'm, I'm a very practical person. I do not believe in uh, having things in your home. Literally just going around the place ruining everything. The entire life has been now ruined. Because this one random guy just showed up and just broke everything. Ah, beauty. No toilet for you. Nope. You are gonna go outside into a bush. This place already looks so much better. And I have, you know, purged most of the bad, bad things. That now we will be actually able to shoot at the raiders over there if we have a sniper rifle. There's gunfire. Position is what caused the world problems. They always wanted more. More. Okay, we need gear. We need gear and circuitry. But right now, all I need is uh, a bed up here. Yep. People who will sleep here are gonna be kinda unhappy, I would say. Good thing I, you know, I made it so that there's so much room now. Now we have 12 beds. Uh, can we make it so that there's gonna be actual water? Yeah, we can actually. Wait. Yeah, we need to actually move it somewhere where you can actually use it. Like this. Okay, so we have water, we have food, we have beds, no protection though. Well, this is gonna be on my new base for a little while. Can I, can I actually dissolve the cat? No, no, let's not think about dissolving the cat, that's wrong. Okay. So we now have a base that we can do operations from. That means we have... Here we have a base. Here we have a base. And here we have a base. We also have a bed here. So we are slowly increasing our influence. What we kind of need is another area further down, you know, like further here. I need to find an area with a bed. It is closer towards the center of that area there. Okay, give me a second. I think this is a job for Shotake. <laughs> Why not? Shit. 
Why can you not reload and sprint? Oh yes, got him. I say him as it's called a doe. Actually, now that I think about it, I kind of want to go back here. You can do double headshot on this thing. Yeah, I'm gonna explore these houses. I've actually not done it. Hopefully we will find something that's gonna have a gear in it and screws and oil, you know. I'm not I'm not a chooser this time around. Just kinda want everything. <laughs> okay, Jed is actually not exactly useful. If this was for a VR, I would be just teleporting everywhere. It would be much quicker. Also much more broken. Hmm. By the way, I've actually seen like a video of the Fallout 4 VR. It's pretty fucking awesome and fucked up. Stimpaks. I have not used a single Stimpak because there is no reason to use Stimpaks. He might be John Doe. God damn it. <laughs> oh, I want the glue. Yes. Lock's really strong. Holy shit, that's an expert lock. I wish you could do just. Uh, okay, just go down here. So, this is where the death claw appeared from. Is it a good idea to go there? Probably not. But I'm probably still gonna do it. I saved, you know, might as well. What could possibly be here? Oh, it's probably like million death calls. Marlurix, eh? And a Brahmin. And a duffel bag. Some interesting shit. Shit, Captain. Plutonium well. Oh, that doesn't seem like a good. This is vanilla. This is a vanilla gameplay. Dude, it's like you n you've never talked to me. Do I look like a person who mod? Ooh, Nuka Cola fucking quantum. Thanks. Alex. Ooh, duct tape. Immediately this was useful. Ah, oh, fuck. Somewhere. Irish. Come on. Yes. Sweet. Another duct tape. Ooh. Not gonna complain about duct tapes, you know, duct tapes are fuck. Pack of salmon, yeah. Down here. Ready? I'm home. Double range.
Shit. Motherfucker. Fuck. <laughs> now that silver locket is actually useful, it has a screw in it. What's in there? This is like ho random holes. Creepy. That reminds me of Nisia. Actually, no, uh, Penumbra, not in. Oh, a Marlor, okay. I think we can take that on right now. There's a corpse who's holding sugar bombs. What the fuck is his? Hello, baby. Yeah, at this point, my looks are actually like absolutely destructive for me. Yeah, someone died there. Resume to the my looks. <sighs> Shotgun is so you. Yeah, Rifleman has been a good choice. It has already helped me greatly. Duct tape, flip lighter, again, very useful. The exit point. Holy shit, there is a bed. I can save. Fusion core. A trifled uh, American fucking flag, okay. Quick hair trigger. <laughs> That's what she said. No medics. Tin cans, because I actually do need steel in the next area. A machete. You know what? I'm actually thinking about getting me a melee weapon. I might as well. Okay, let's drop a save. This is really good. That means I actually don't have to be like super scared of this area now. And a fusion core. There's the guy who died. Gun shells are always useful. Never gonna say no. Maybe when you can. Oh, okay. So like, is that a new message? It's actually hard to say which messages are new and which are not. But. Uh Yeah, this guy died horribly. Maybe we can open this crate now. Yes. 
that Red X is useful. So close to leveling. So where exactly am I going to appear if I leave from this exit? Get ready. In before this is like a hive of fucking Marlurks and there's going to be a Queen and it's going to be like, Oh, I see you are a low level character. Blah, 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 blah. Or not. Okay. I'm okay with this. Okay, we are gonna go back to our Bernard farm. Drop our shit. I have to say, when you are looking at the big picture, uh, this game is actually pretty nice. You know, like nice looking. But like, if you are looking at uh, the specific things, then this game is <laughs> batshit ugly. And, you know, it sucks because, you know, like... I still say that, you know, Fallout 3 and New Vegas are still pretty nice looking games even today. Especially if you, like, slightly mod them. But Fallout 4 just doesn't look that good. And it's not the fact that I'm... It's not the fact that I'm only playing on high and not on ultra. Hey kitty, 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 kitty. I'm retarded. Okay, so I brought a lot of things. Can we build anything useful? I dropped the red bandana. A lot of water. The bombs. Okay. I do not need a 308 because I still don't have a hunting rifle. You are like some point and people uh, like notice me. What do you mean? Just I have two. Okay. And. Okay. Can we make gun turret? Still not, we need more gear. Hmm. Shite. So we are gonna go back into the Concord after I drop a save. Never forget to drop a save, this is how you die. This is gonna fill up my HP. Man, these, these locations are really good for, like, you know, just getting some HP back. So let's get back to Concord. And find more shit. have 20 shotgun shells so we are pretty much that for any like normal sized encounter there's a corpse nothing on him what's in here oh desk fan no nuka cherry cherry pentamon caps I'm just expecting traps at this point, everywhere. Do 
do I get? How do I get up there? Hmm. I think I actually need a jetpack to get there. Yeah, because I cannot actually jump that. It's like blocking me in order to jump. So only with a jetpack. There's actually a lot of locations in this game that actually have like things in them that you can only get to with jetpack. They were like real proud of that feature. Speaky. Fuck is that? Anyone here? Probably not. Start stealing. Start stealing. Ask questions later. Steal now. Pick up everything. Even the deflated fucking ball. Man, if I'm gonna install any, I lay down my trap in face of face of defense position. That's a Yu-Gi-Oh joke. Let's do this. And I leveled. Very useful, actually. A lot of bottles that I can turn into to water really there's I'm still ready to shoot things the bars that serve illegal alcohol during the time I see so prohibition did actually happen in this got it Yeah, the reason you die is because you had an auto pistol. They do suck. <gasps> Hunting rifle, yeah! Fucking yes! Oh my god, we finally have a sniper gun. That is not a laser gun. That actually makes me so happy. Now we have to, we have to survive now. and cheese wow that's creepy that's really creepy actually my cheese I'm almost over again the f uh, I do not wanna I do not want to know. Do not want to know. What? You know what? I really don't want to go. Uh, just finish exploring and fuck off. I actually don't want to be here anymore. Let's just go.
I think I picked up everything important. Okay. So let's go back to Abernathy. Aberna We have shit to dump. Hopefully some gear. So that we can actually, you know, finally give them some fucking de defense. And the shotgun has been so useful so far. But I would rather have like a ta uh, tactical, you know, shotgun. Like automatic. N not automatic, like... Uh, Modern shotgun, basically, not, uh, not this shotgun. Is this the same as for history from the 1945? Rest of the world, I see. I don't know, I was never much into the Fallout lore because... Fallout 2 fucked up Fallout 1 lore and then every Fallout game afterwards just fuck the lore even more. I mean, for instance, here the the ghouls somehow do not need to eat and drink, which is pretty fucked up. Okay, we have an absolute shit tons of things here. I keep the machete. I'm gonna start working on that. That's future sniper gun. Holy shit, that's cool. We thirty-eight millimeter is kind of shit. I'm gonna start the, the getting me this ammo as well. So question, did we get any gear with all of that? Yes, we actually did. We got quite a lot of gear actually. Now the guns are gonna be on top here. Okay, now this place has some defense. You need circuit eh? no. How good is that vantage point? It's actually pretty good. Not too shabby. So anyone who will want to enter, they will have to get shot by this gun. That can actually shoot all the way here. So the so for the enemy to get through, they would have to like literally hug the wall. Which later on I will have another gun here that will like protect this like down area here. I just want to trade a few things. Of course. Wait, she's shotgun sure shows. Just money? Just corn? Oh my god, I should talk to these people more often. Hi. Blake told me what you did for us. For Mary. I know it's not much, but any trading you want to do, I'll go easy on the price. Uh, let me know if there's anything you want to take a look at. Okay. How are you holding up? Thanks to you. Better. Mary was a good kid. She had fire in her. I can't tell you how many arguments we had. <laughs> that girl hated rules, and believe me, I had plenty. You did your best. Did I? What's the best you can do in a world like this? We knew the risks of having kids these days, and we took them. But it was worth it. I won't argue that. Anyway, enough. I'm sure you got plenty of your own thoughts to deal with rather than listen to mine. But like I said, if you need something, just let me know. 
It's not every day a stranger comes along and helps us out the way you did. All right. Wait, what's she? Ooh, she's actually selling some awesome shit. Oh. Like 308 rounds. Shipment of Kung. Kumpadurvik. Don't mind buying this. And I will give you for that. Hmm. Yep, and accept. Okay. So now I, I actually have, you know, like bullets to shoot with that rifle. But we need to, we need to level up now. Let's see. Can we get gun nut? No, we need to wait for level 13. Okay. That's not going to happen in a, for a while. Yeah, expert logs would help. I like those. Uh, I like your speaking voice in the gameplay. What do you mean by that? I have a voice, yes. <laughs> it just... okay. Oh, that's a red rocket. Yeah, we are almost near Sanctuary. We need to get to Sanctuary. In order to upgrade our sniper, yeah, like future sniper rifle. I'm actually gonna pick up as much shit as I can here to get that shit going. Hmm. I actually already like super looted this place. Oh, flip lighter! No, I didn't. Tired from lack of sleep, yet I literally just slept. I heard something, but it's probably just my imagination. So, is uh, Preston having a walk in water again? Nope. Nope, he didn't feel like doing that today. Comforting on the ears and the gameplay style of yours is enjoyable to watch. Well, wish everyone thought that. I would I would not mind having like other people watch me. Because if you have not noticed, not, not many people watch me. Oh, it is actually growing already. Okay. Shit. Can we do anything with the hunting rifle? First things first. Yeah, a medium score would be pretty fucking awesome on it. <laughs> so that's basically it, because we need adhesive. Now, I actually have a plan for adhesive. Wait a second. Horn. This is one of the things we need to be able to make our own adhesive. So I will show something that's in this game. Not many people actually know about it. There's actually a way how to build your own adhesive. If you go to vegetable starch, uh, it, ma it wants mood fruit, corn, potatoes and purified water. Now you can get all of these pretty easily. You just need to, you know, start getting them. Probably the biggest bitch to get is corn and mood fruit. Especially mood fruit, because the closest area where you 100% get mood fruit is really far south. 
Well, not very far south, but for this mode, it's pretty far. So if we ever find anyone who has mood fruit, I will 100% take that from them. I swear to god, there were people sitting here just now. Anyway, to save. Actually, I'm tired. Uh, six hours. I'd like to trade some items. Hmm, can I do something with my armor? Yeah, I need adhesive for that as well. You need you basically need adhesive for everything in this game, which is a problem. Kinda sucks. And at some point at some point we will get mood fruit, we'll get more corn and shit is gonna finally start working. Also There's another thing that we need to do. Over. Yep, that's the radio that we need. Now, the radio has to be in an area that is easily protected. Because enemies will go for the radio. So what we need to do now... Is to build... A couple wooden walls. Around this. Oh, I like this. Now the problem is the game will actually be like, oh yeah, you you need to like, you need to like be an idiot. The like, it's actually kind of hard to force the game to understand what you want to do. See? Like, why? Like that. So now this area is slightly better. The bullets stick like to the piercing you. Well. So now this area is gonna be slightly better protected. And now the radio needs to be connected to the main pylon. Construct additional pylon. So from now on, we are going to be getting people here. This is going to help. I love how the game is like, build the generator, goddammit. Okay, okay, I'm going to build it, man. I mean, I'm gonna build a big one. Just for you, game. Just for you. Uh, the big one is gonna be over here. And again, I'm gonna build walls around it. Just to make it so that, uh, you know, you're not gonna get butt fucked. Actually, get it over there? Yes, I can. That helps. Again, build an awesome wall here. This one is going to be kind of beige. Okay, seriously, close. You're pissing me off. No. 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 Why do you stick? <laughs> Oh. See? Why? Why is it doing that? This is so so bad. Now they can shoot at it. The only thing you can do now is to build like a real retarded wall. 
between these two points. God damn it, I wish it was a mouse one. Oh, seriously, whoever thought of controls for this shit was absolutely brain dead. Oh. Yeah, now we have this area that's, you know, pretty well protected. And we have this area here that's pretty well protected. So another thing that we I'm gonna do now is give me a second. It. There it is. I now need to connect these. Connect that. Yeah, that's probably gonna be it. Because this uh, here area is actually pretty good for more like turrets and shit. At some point I'm gonna build like a wall around here with like a gatehouse. And there's gonna be another gatehouse here. But you know, that's gonna be in the future. That's not gonna happen right now at all. Basically, if enemies will want to attack us, it will take a lot of effort. And that's exactly what we want, you know, we want to make it hard for them to attack us. You know what I call a good day? One that ends without an empty stomach. Well, then go work on, on a field. I think we've met yet. Anyway, I just wanted to say thanks for the opportunity. Any place you want me to pitch in? Did you need anything? I don't think so. Things are actually going pretty good. Okay. So this area is protected. This area here isn't. So we actually need to build a wall here. So now it's gonna be quite a bitch for them to shoot anyone through that. This, this reminds me of Rust a little, except Rust was an indie game basically. So there I, I would be like, okay, it's kind of buggy, but you know, indie game. Uh, we have two defensive turrets here that are going to be shooting outside and then we have one here and in the future there's going to be one there. Second. Yep, there's going to be another one here. And that way, we will have pretty good defense from all sides. Wait, what? I didn't... What? I didn't do that. Game, stop being retarded. You really cannot jump at all when it comes to buildings.
soon we will actually be working on lights. Because lights are gonna be a pretty big deal. Because the raiders love to attack at night. But you can see shit. Hey man. Ma'am. Sanctuary. I knew you'd join us here, kid. Your energy is tied to this place. I hope the color of my energy is blue. <laughs> That's good. Humor is a good way to cope. Because this world ain't yours, is it? I saw you leave that ice box. The site can help you, kid. It always has answers. Just gotta bring me some jet so I can see what it wants to tell you. What's jet? It's a little inhaler that packs a big kick. They say it makes you move faster, but at my age, it's more of a quick rush. The chems do the site, so it's not always gonna be jet I'm asking for. But that's what's on the menu this time. No. You're an addict. You need help. Oh, not this again. Kid, listen to me. I'm old. Even older than you think. If the chems are gonna kill me, then I say I've had a good run. You have never made it this far without the sight. I need it. You need it. It's part of who I am. Hmm. Isn't there any way you can use the sight without chems? Let me tell you a story, kid. Oh God. Once, what have I done? A beautiful young girl with a special power. Used to get in all kinds of crazy adventures. She meets a handsome young boy, but he doesn't like her power. Thinks it makes her a slave to something evil. And so the power goes away, and it's not there when the girl and the boy need it most. Now the boy's gone, and the girl is old. But she has friends, and her power keeps them safe. That's all that matters. We'll talk to persuade him. The sight isn't worth killing yourself over no more, Murphy. It doesn't have to define what you are or what you can give. All right, kid. Holy shit, Bort. If me hanging around for a little longer is worth that much to you, then I'll go clean. No more cams, no more sight. Okay. I I actually did not expect that to go to work. Let's trade some things. And now she's basically just a normal person. I'm actually gonna save it. There was a lot of things that. Okay, let's drink. Okay, and let's eat. Let's have. Some food. Food. Coming in pretty good. Happy to hear that, man. Actually, now that I think about it, I want to do one more thing here for the defense. That way there will be guards, you know, sniping everything here. And I kind of want to do the same thing on... If at all possible. Yeah. Yeah, now it's a purple, like, defense area. Okay, now I'm gonna drop a save. <laughs> Again, it's very... Like, you spend a lot of time in bed in this game. Okay. okay let's have a look. Yeah, now this place looks uh, pretty... Pretty dangerous. All things considered. Like, if someone tries to attack us, they will have to go around all of this. They will have to go here, and suddenly there's three turrets shooting them at the same time. Pretty cool, you know, it's compact. I like it. 
Okay, uh, now we are gonna actually finally go uh, where the game wanted me to go. That means Tempine's Bluff. But yeah, I'm gonna be honest, uh, I really do not like uh, the limitation of not being able to save. Also, I would like if the damage would be increased on both sides, if the damage would be increased on both the enemy and you. Like, get rid of the whole idea of everyone being a bullet sponge. You know, and just make them fragile, but you know, just leave the damage as it is. That way, you know, like headshots and such, you know, sniping is much better. Which it already kinda is. But, you know, it will not take like million shots to kill someone. This is getting tetanus, is getting higher and higher. What do you mean? Someone just straight up died. Fucking knew it. Fuck you. More. We need more shotgun shells. We <laughs> need much more shotgun shells. Okay, so this was like an ambush by fucking... Fucking mole rats. Mole rats have been such an asshole in this playthrough. Anyway, let's go. We are gonna be actually going over there, where you see the little, like, the towers. That's where we are gonna be going. Next time. Not now, next time, definitely. Oh, figure the excavations. Is it bugging out? Is it bugging out? I don't think it is. I don't think for once uh, this place is not actually bugging out. Now the important place about this, or the imp important thing about the figured excavation is that there was a bed there, I'm pretty sure. How close am I? Rusted metal. Uh, I know what tetanus is, I'm just, why are you talking about it? Sprinting is actually really bad because you need the AP to be able to shoot people. I found something. More area here. Someone probably lived here for a second before they died. I have to test out uh, the gun we have. Shit. Absolutely destroyed. Okay, this is a problem. This is this is why we have pretty high luck. Oh, 
Oh, it's a legendary shit. Motherfucker. This is bad. Oh, I have no AP, I forgot. Yes, I knew Mood Fruit. Die! Okay, what's up with the first legendary weapon? Oh, yes. Mm. Yes! That's good. That's actually really good. Now we must not die. Whatever happens, we must not die. It is no longer allowed. Why I'm going here? Die over it. Fucking fire. <laughs> We are almost there. We are almost in Tempine's Bluff. Come on. Don't die. We are finally here. Why am I over the line? Why am I... Okay. I couldn't move. That's a lot of potatoes. No mood fruits. God damn it. Not much, but it's something. Hello. What do you want? We don't need any more trouble around here. If I told you I'm with the Minutemen, would you still want to shoot me? You're with the Minutemen? I didn't really think you fellas still existed. We sent word with one of them passing traders, but honestly, I never expected anything to come of it. Most people don't put much stock in the Minutemen these days. After Quincy. Bad business, that. Yeah, I'm independent of back. We're rebuilding the Minutemen from the ground up. We're the good guys again. Glad to hear it. No question that things have been worse since the Minutemen fell to pieces. There's a raider gang that's been given a... Okay, I have to say one thing about this game. Threatening to kill us all if we don't this game is older than Mass Effect Andromeda. Can't go up against a gang Yet the faces actually look better. Will you be willing to join the Minutemen once I've dealt with those raiders? We'll certainly give it a good long think. People have gotten used to not being able to count on you folks. That's not going to change overnight. Except it will literally change overnight. I'm not even joking. We've been any of those. Okay. The plan is to go back to Ficket X. Actually, no, to the satellite. Make it to the satellite, and from the satellite, there's a bed there. I can rest there, save the game, keep the pistol, go back to Sanctuary, modify the pistol, because the pistol I have right now is actually pretty good. Yeah, that's the plan. Man, I would kill to be able to teleport right now. I, I do not want to go all the way. Nope, 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 nope. I know there are some really nasty raiders here. I know there is a raider with a, with a like, like a nuke launcher. Do not want to deal with that at all. No, 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 no. It is not... I'm not buying whatever that... There's something moving. I do not even want to know. Make it to the bed. Make it to the bed. Yeah, it was the explosive small red. This is just a fridge in the middle of nowhere. It's 
sneaky, sneaky, sneak. Save. Okay. Now we need to make it to Sanctuary. I'm gonna pick up this one. Okay, we have saved. Now all we have to do is to get to Sanctuary and I'm gonna take a break. I hate it that you cannot use escape to get away from the fucking pip boy. Ugh. I really hate how Bethesda hates uh, the, like common new controls using games. You pass a couple. Uh, that's a vowed mud fruit. That's not. Uh, that is not the one that you can use, sadly. Sadly, agriculture is not part of this game. You cannot... You cannot agriculture vault things. Probably take generations anyway. Generations. Failing. Is it a good idea to every now and then just try whether you are hidden or not? Yeah, we can we can cross it here. Oh, sanctuary, baby! The beautiful side of this horror, horrible, horrible building I'm building here. Yes. Seems to be oh wait, he on. just said... See, I actually react to it. <laughs> it's so weird for, you know, like, games to actually call my name. This might be the first game that actually, you know, like, calls out my name. Okay, so we have shit tons of potatoes here. So what we need to do is dump my shit here. Wow, well, I have so many 10 millimeter bullets. So I'm gonna get rid of the machete. I keep most of the Blowing fungus. Ice cold nuka. Ooh. Yeah, those nuka cola quantums I'm gonna dump. Cherry nuka cola is gonna be dumped as well. Some of this uh, water is gonna get dumped. Sugar, the potato. Okay. My name is in the games database. What's your name? Get rid of the O, because we do not use that ammo at all. Okay. Okay, time to take shit from that gun. Okay. And let's start putting that shit on this gun. Short barrel, long barrel, comfort grip, reflex sight. I'm gonna rename you to that that gun mark two. So you are gonna be Nico. Wait, is that a name? 
You're gonna scrub this for some steel. You can't really do anything because no adhesive still. So we now have a much better 10 millimeter pistol. Shit. Na 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 na. Accidentally threw a Molotov. It's okay, ignore that. I'm just burning some grass. Just burning some grass. Ignore that. I'm not crazy yet. Give it some time. <laughs> okay. So I'm generally gonna be running around with the pistol. The pistol is. Jesus! I have a really, really itchy trigger finger. Uh, if needed, I can just, you know, be here, you know, shoot at the raiders from here. Or I can go up here and shoot at the raiders from one of the many windows here. Pew, 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 basically. The only problem is gonna be if the raiders are gonna be coming from here, and that's gonna be solved very soon with the ladder then. Stairs, I should say. Let's trade. Do I look like I want to chit chat? Uh, if I could save, I would so blo blow your head off. That's so many things for you, if I. Yeah, we are gonna take a break. Sadly, we did not do the whole uh, Corriga thing. So we will do it next time, most likely. I like the animation my character does when I pull out the gun, which is why, I'm, why, I, keep, why I keep doing it. I'm actually gonna go up here and let's look at how our place looks. Yeah, it actually does look pretty fucking solid. Ooh, that, that makes me happy. That actually does make me happy. That legitimately looks fucking awesome. That actually looks like an area that, you know, I would build in real life. Just the walls would be kind of less shit. Oh, generally this would have like much less walls, generally. And I would most likely cut down like these buildings around. So that there is as little cover outside of the actual cover as possible. But yeah. So next time we are going to be um, doing the quest for the Tampines Bluff. And pretty far away. That's going to be the furthest we have ever gone. That's going to be a fucking journey. We are also going to go uh, into Thicket Excavations. Uh, just to finish it off. So what we are going to do is go to Thicket, you know, finish what's there, then go south to Corbiga. If anyone knows if there are any usable beds or, you know, settlements that I could settle in this general area here, give me a heads up. I would really love to know. Because I don't know. I know we will soon take over Tampines Bluff, which will basically make it so that we will be able to kind of be able to reach around here in this kind of like circle so i'm gonna go here and i'm gonna finish these areas here because there's a lot of like bullshit here uh then from abernathy farm i'm most likely gonna go r like around here into like i know there's like a military base here that i can you know take over but yeah this area like this square kind of towards Corviga is where I need settlements and I do not know if there are any. So, yeah. Anyway, I wish you all a great day. I would like to thank you for watching. Uh, make sure that if you enjoy my content to follow me on uh, Twitch and subscribe to me on my YouTube channel. I upload videos every day if YouTube or Twitch or my internet or whatever allows me. Also, like the videos if you like them, share them around, especially on Reddit, that helps a lot. 
and, you know, comment. I love to reply to comments. Anyway, like I said, I wish you a great day, night, afternoon, or whatever sexy hearts want. Goodbye. Goodbye.